Xiao Bang. Hi, and welcome back to Tasty Khmer Viet Kitchen. Today, I'm going to show you how to make a delicious Thai beef salad that's bursting with flavor. This dish is refreshing and future tender slices of beef, fresh herb, and a zesty dressing. Um, so let's get started. So these are the ingredients we will need for our steak salad tonight. Um, I'm using the flank, uh, beef flank steak and it's a little bit less than two pounds. Uh, this recipe you could do, uh, you know, a little bit under, uh, up to two pounds. Let's get started. Uh, so I'm just uh, sli uh, cutting uh, our palm sugar. So I'm just chopping it up, making sure it's uh, as uh, chopped up as possible so it can work its magic pasta on our steak and on our marination. So I am uh, gonna chop off the cilantro and we are going to use um, the stem as part of our marination and then for uh, the leaf portion it's going to be part become part of our salad this salad is not just about um, uh, the meat but it's all you know the herbs becomes uh, the salad itself so it's all about the herbs as well so we're gonna uh, I put my garlic and my uh, uh, cilantro stem in a food processor and then I'm going to blend it. So I am going to, uh, I'm putting in the blended garlic and cilantro stem. I'm adding our sugar. Fish sauce. Have a teaspoon of uh, black pepper, and then we're just gonna marinate it and let it rest for a little bit while we prep our um, our uh, vegetables. So as you can see, this is from my garden, and we're just gonna pick the leaves off, and then we're uh, this is uh, going to go. I use a lot of herbs because it's a uh, part of the salad. And this is fresh from my garden. Okay, I am done with our mint. And uh, I'm gonna leave half without being uh, without touching it, and then the other half I'm gonna li uh, lightly uh, slice it or chop it up a little bit. I don't want it too small. And then that's all I'm gonna do. So these are the. Uh, uh, green onions, scallions from my garden as well. I'm just gonna slice it um, uh, about an inches apart. I don't want it small for this for the salad. And now we're done. So I'm adding uh, uh, two pieces of sweet pepper. Try to remove the seed. So I'm also cutting up uh, three uh, Thai chili pepper. I like my uh, salad a little bit spicy. You can, uh, it's optional. You can uh, omit it if you don't need spice. Um, so for the tomato, I, uh, you, I'm i using regular tomato, but if you ha uh, use cherry tomato, it's probably better. It looks better and you can get the sweet tomato as well. But I'm using the regular tomato for this dish right now. For the uh, sweet onion, I'm just gonna dice, uh, slice it like this. And we're gonna uh, let it sit in a bath of ice cold water like we normally do. So I am putting uh, the ice bath uh, for the onions and we're gonna let it sit there until we finish up with our other um, vegetable. So I am uh, just uh, peeling the uh, cucumber lightly. And then I'm gonna chop it in the middle. And then I'm gonna scoop the seed out because the seed makes it super watery in our salad. Uh, you should be slicing this about quarter inch. Okay, we're done. Okay, I am going, uh, I'm gonna just squeeze it on. Since I don't need a whole, since I don't need a whole lot, I am not using the machine, I'm just doing it manually. But if I need a whole lot of lime juice, fresh lime juice, I'll use my machine, it's fast and easy. We are doing the dressing right now for the salad. Sugar, fish sauce, and lime juice. And we're just gonna mix it. 
We're going to set it aside while we cook our steak. So I'm adding oil. I am using, uh, so I'm going to cook our flat and steak. On high heat. So our steak has been cooking for about three minutes now. I'm gonna flip it. You can see uh, uh, the charnas because uh, we marinated with sugar, and that's all we want. We're gonna cook it uh, about uh, three to four minutes on each side. So uh, the steak, uh, if you like it medium rare. Uh, you should turn off the fire and let the steak rest. Uh, but for my family, we like it more um, medium well, so we're gonna cook it for a few more minutes. So uh, our herbs and uh, vegetables and uh, sauce and steaks are ready. We're just waiting for the steak to cool down and we cut it up and then we're gonna toss and assemble our uh, steak salad. So our steak has been rested for 15 minutes now and we're gonna cut it up. Wow, it's 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 good. It's you know it's perfect. It's not too rare, and um, this is a texture that you want in your steak. Just cutting it uh, about a quarter of an inches. I I let it rest for about fifteen minutes before cutting it up so it can retain the moist, the juice, lock up the juice before we cut it up. That's all. Try to resist from, uh, you know, uh, taking a bite because that's what I'm really doing. It smells so good. And um, hold your temptation. It's almost ready. Okay, we're done with the steak. So we're going to toss our salad. This is the steak that we cut. And we're going to put in our cucumber, our sweet onion and tomato. Then I'm going to put in our scallion, our cilantro. Ooh, my bowl is quite small here. <laughs> and pepper. Ooh. And then I'm going to, the dressing that we did, I'm going to glaze it. Then I'm going to toss it. Toss it. Oh my goodness, mouth watering. And we're gonna put our whole dressing sauce that we mix. Okay, our steak salad is ready. I am going to plate it. Mmm, looks delicious. Okay, we are done. Look at that. The steak salad is completed. It looks so delicious. So our beef salad is completed. I'm gonna give it a try, see how it comes out to be. Mm. I'll try to take smaller bites. Mmm. Really good. Delicious. Give it a try. I hope you enjoyed this recipe for a Thai beef salad. You can find a full list of ingredients in the link provided below. Uh, give it a try at home and let us know how it turns out. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our Tasty Khmer Viet Kitchen for more amazing recipe. Until next time, happy cooking!